G'day, it's Jamie, and welcome to Where's My Yowie. Today, I'm reading an old newspaper report about a dead sea monster, possible kraken, that was found at Cape Banks Lighthouse in South Australia. So we'll get into it. This was published in Tasmania's Zeehan and Dundas Herald on Thursday, the 4th of September, 1913, titled, A Strange Monster. We take the following from an exchange without any comment, except to wonder if the animal is in any way related to the stranger in distress, which the state prospecting party discovered on the beach near Port Hibbs when prospecting for minerals and not for monsters. The president of the South Australian Marine Board, Mr. A. Cece, has forwarded the following letter concerning a strange animal which was found recently on the sea coast near Cape Banks to Mr. J. R. G. Adams, Secretary of the Adelaide Public Library. It is written by the head keeper at Cape Banks Lighthouse. The animal mentioned, I am afraid, will be too far gone to do anything with. The size on top measurements is six feet by five feet. The hair or wool is somewhat between the two. The body has grizzly bone and it will weigh between six or seven hundred pounds. It is like a gigantic cuttlefish. I tried to get the mouth but could not turn it. One man who has been to see it cannot place it and he has been sailing in all parts of the world. It is of the octopus family. I wish to mention a brown one came ashore some time before the white one, but too far gone to do anything with. There is on the beach near the Glen Rosa a thing about 33 feet long and 8 inches through. The end. Well, this is amazing what these guys have found. It's either like a giant squid or something like that, or like the Kraken, as we all know, like the giant squid thing. Um, they're saying that the measurements on top, the top measurements were six feet by five feet, which is huge. They're saying it had hair or wool or something in between. Uh, it has grizzly bone and it weighs between six and 700 pounds, which is like, that's huge. Um, they reckon it's a, cut, a giant cuttlefish maybe because that's what the head looked like and the the tentacles were probably cut off because they found another one on the beach just around the corner near the Glen Rosa, which is a shipwreck that's still there on the beach. And the tentacle was 33 feet long and eight inches through. And they're positive it's of the octopus family. So I'd love to know what exactly it was, but it's all really interesting stuff. Okay, that's it for me. I'll get back to you all next time. Bye.